Hello, I'm here at 1805 uh, Knox Avenue, Sanford, Florida. Three bedrooms, one and a half bath, uh, 1,037 or 1,057 square feet. Just going to do a little tour of the neighborhood. Airplane heading into uh, Sanford, Florida, Sanford International Airport, I suspect. So this little home does need some love. It's been around a long time. Uh, brick. Pretty solid home. Plenty of storage here under this space. You could fit, uh, I don't know, five or seven cars if you wanted. Little room there, a uh, little storage room. We're going to walk inside and kind of give you a feel of what this, this home offers. Needs, needs flooring. Uh, as we walk into the living room, dining area, I'm going to spin around here and let you see the whole, that whole area. Okay, then we're going to head to the kitchen. Take a look at it. See it includes a refrigerator and a range. I'll show you all of that and show it to you from a different angle here. It's a fridge. And then we're going to spin back and look at the living room from this angle. And we're going to head down to the uh, bedrooms. This bedroom, I'm going to call it bedroom two. Uh, Reach-in closet. This uh, little area is close to everything. I mentioned Sanford International Airport. Downtown Sanford, just a little ways away. 2016 AC unit, 2020 hot water heater. Roof is older. Here's the primary suite. Peel and stick floors. It's got a half bath. carpet. Then we're going to look at uh, bedroom three. Bedroom three may be the smallest of the bedrooms. It's also got a small carpet. Slightly sloped roof. And then the full bath. Of course I showed you the half already. Full bath. Okay now let's go take a look at the uh, let's go look out back. We're going to walk through this uh, floor room. There is an AC vent in here. I do not believe it's included in the square footage. I do believe there's some termite damage on that wall. It's all exposed so you can see it. Uh, it doesn't seem to be an issue, but of course I'm not a termite expert. But you can see what's there. Okay. Now we're going to, there's that, that, that vent I spoke of. Let's head out back. Electrical panel appears to be newish. Just gonna nothing much to see over there. It's fenced on three sides in the back. Two large sheds. I'm guessing 10 by 14 and 10 by 10. A large area in the middle here for I don't know if you want to sit and just have a little privacy or if you want to want to have a workshop or something along those lines. There's the 10 by 10 shed I mentioned. Another little storage area in the back. Uh, roof needs to be replaced on that little thing. There's, there's no roof there. So uh, that's it for our tour. Thanks for watching.